You all know the digits in noise test, right? The din? Of course! It's a hearing test, often used as a screening tool, where the listener needs to repeat digit triplets in noise. Woohoo! Actually, the test is for humans, not for bunnies. Aww! In the original test, the speech and noise signals are presented identically and simultaneously to both ears. This is called a dyotic presentation. Huh. However, the dyotic din has some downsides. Woohoo! I passed! But I'm deaf in one ear. That's right! It leaves unilateral hearing loss undetected because the outcome is based on the better ear. And there's another downside. Woohoo! I passed! But I have conductive hearing loss. Indeed, it fails to detect conductive hearing loss as the hearing loss can simply be compensated by increasing the volume of the test. But don't worry, Bunny, a recent variant of the DIN, the antiphasic DIN, tackled these issues. Here, the speech signals are phase inverted between the ears, and the noise is in phase. So? Well, this has significantly improved the sensitivity of the DIN to detecting all types of hearing loss. Are you sure? You're right, Bunny. A scientist must always be skeptical. That's why Bolspool and colleagues conducted a study to evaluate the screening characteristics of the test. They simulated unilateral and bilateral hearing loss by using earplugs. Huh? They also assessed whether the presentation level of the antiphasic DIN affects the speech recognition threshold. Sounds interesting! You can now read all about it in the International Journal of Audiology. Bunny approved!